Hello friends, today I am here to demonstrate iPod Advance, a new device for insulin injections without the needle touching the skin, which improves the adherence and absorption. And uh, this is a device and this is how it looks like. So I am going to open the packet. So I am removing it. I am going to open the lid. It is available in two lengths of the candela. This one is 6 mm and it is also available at 9 mm length. Only a very soft candela goes inside. There won't be any metallic part inside the skin. So this is the adhesive tape and this is the cap over the needle which I have removed. So I believe that you are on uh, four injections per day, right? Yes. And uh, this is going to be a blessing for you, I promise. And I remove the bottom part and I am uh, pulling out this inserted device and these are the two areas where I am going to squeeze together. So this is the area where I have cleaned previously and I promise you there won't be any any pain at all, right? Shall I? Yes. So I am going to squeeze these two simultaneously and this and then press this part. So which are all the injections you are pressing in? <coughs> no reference and this. No rapid and So you can have both these injections over here. Can you see a central part over here? This is the area which we call as a septum and I will demonstrate an injection over here. And uh, this is the regular injection. I, I will have uh, two units uh, for you as part of this demonstration. And this is the central area. So I have injected. So I'll wait for 10 seconds and then I will pull out the needle. So so simple right yes and you can have even up to 75 injections in three days and this is the new uh, injection uh, port uh, for the administration of insulin and even other medications subcutaneously and this is a new device and it's a very simple device and it will remain there. It need to be removed every three days. So that's all with this demonstration of the new iPod. Thank you so much, my dear friends, for your patience and for your precious time. Bye-bye from Jyotidesh.